What if I tell you that there is a secret version of Windows that you cannot find easily in any Microsoft's website or in any online third-party websites? One that is not from Microsoft, even it is not a genuine release of the Microsoft Corporation. One that ended its life before its actual release and that is called as the Windows 9. So before we getting into the video, you need to know the history of Windows. Starting from 25th October 2001, Microsoft is releasing Windows XP. It was loved by everyone. It is fast and with a nice looking UI. Even now, there are about a 3.27% of Windows XP users are there all over the world. And Microsoft has officially ended its support in 18th April 2014 and then Windows Vista was released on 30th November 2006. It was very slow and sluggish and buggy. It was one of the most worst rated operating systems from Microsoft Corporation. Microsoft improved the UI by making it more stylish and polished. In later point of time, Microsoft ended its support in 11th April 2017. Then Microsoft released Windows 7 on 22nd October 2009, which was loved by everyone for its performance and its UI. The UI was a bit similar to Windows Vista, but even it was loved by everyone because it is so fast and smooth to use and a very lightweight OS. But then Microsoft also ended its extended support of life on 14th January 2020. Then Microsoft released Windows 8 which does not have a start menu itself. So customers didn't like the Windows 8 at all. The reason for releasing Windows 8 without the start menu is because of it was made specifically for touch screen laptops and PCs. Then it got died in 12th January 2016. Followed by Windows 8, Windows 8.1 was released on 27th August 2013. But this time they included start menu in that release even though it is not popular, it was hated by people. So Microsoft has to release a new operating system and they named it as Windows 9. They even almost finished the development of Windows 9. They even released the beta release of uh, Windows 9 for insiders in Windows Insider program. But they skipped the release of Windows 9 and released Windows 10 for some reasons. Windows 10 was released on 29th July 2015 and they announced that Windows 10 is their last OS and no new versions of Windows will be released in the future. And Windows 9 was forgotten. But some software engineers have made a custom build based on Windows 8.1 Embedded Edition and made some changes in the UI to make it look like Windows 7 and they call it Windows 9. And since this is an Embedded Edition, you can't just simply buy a genuine product key for activating Windows. So you should use an activator for activating the windows illegally. Check the description for more info with activation. And also you will not be secure with this operating system. Since this is a custom build you will not get any security updates or software updates from Microsoft. So you should use a third party antivirus for being safe. Ok so enough talking. Now let's begin the installation process shall we? So right now I'm inside my laptop and I've already downloaded the ISO file. Let us let me open files and inside that the downloads folder you can see that Windows 9.zip file. So this is a zip file. I'll give the link in the description box down below for downloading this zip file, okay? And from here, let's right click and extract here. Yeah, extract here. 
and now it will extract so let's wait so after extracting let's open the folder you can see that win 9 64 bit english us uh, iso let's rename this to make it more comfortable for locating the iso file so windows 9 okay iso and we have windows 9 iso and let's move this to my iso folder well i created a separate folder for iso files and let's move that to there and let's just close files and now uh, VMware Workstation Pro let's open that and I've already done the video to help you with the installation uh, how to install VMware Workstation Pro 16 full version in Ubuntu click the I button to uh, view that video okay and create a new virtual machine typical is good recommended okay next and browse let's just click browse so it's okay Windows 9 ISO open okay you can see that it's detected as Windows 8.164 bit because as I said before it is an embedded edition of Windows 8.1 and yeah next and let us just rename the user cyber Zypher. and let's just keep it in the pro edition but I recommend you to keep it in the 8.1 the default edition let's just set a password confirm password next and let's rename it as Windows 9 let's browse the folder that you like to install this new virtual machine okay I've look at the folder open next store virtual disk in a single file 60 gigs is okay so next and yeah finish and this will create the new disk the new virtual disk so let's just wait okay 97 98 99 yeah and now this will open the new virtual machine so let's just wait let's keep it in the full screen mode okay so yeah oh it's glitchy and view full screen mode okay good so now let's follow the regular installation process shall we so the setup is started okay you can see that windows 9.1.9.6 plus oh my god this is a custom built OS as I said before so that's weird next and VMware is so useful for you comparing to VirtualBox Oracle VM VirtualBox VMware is so user friendly so I recommend you VMware okay now it's time for a satisfying time lapse shall we Hope you enjoyed the time lapse guys and now it is applying user okay it's preparing windows i think it will take some time so again let's just wait so it's installing the vmware tools uh, let's just minimize that so it's here it you can see that windows 
8.1 Embedded Industry Pro Build 9600 Edition. It looks like Windows 7 and also it does also resembles Windows Vista. You can see that the start menu does resembles Windows 7 and Windows Vista. And there are so many changes and also uh, it is very laggy to tell. You can see that. Let's refresh this page. You can see that it's so laggy. Let's try to adjust the resolution guys. So yeah it's so much slower I don't know why it is good to use because it is so you know it gives you a new feel so let's adjust the resolution and apply okay and keep changes okay so finally it's here we've installed Windows 9 isn't it crazy yes it is crazy and this is nothing but windows 8.1 in a skin of windows 9 okay it comes with google chrome inbuilt oh my god it comes with google chrome inbuilt i don't know is this legal or illegal i i don't know to you to use this operating system it is um, i don't know what to say it's because uh, you know you can see that the glassy texture behind uh, you can see that it's it's a transcurrent background guys transcurrent theme or whatever you call it so so that's it for today guys I really hope that you enjoyed this video please if you want to see more please um, like share and comment and also subscribe to my channel wait wait we've not completed one thing I need to open Winver to explain you this. So here is Winver. So Winver is here. You can see that Windows 8. Point, sorry, only Windows. Windows 8 Embedded Edition. Okay, guys, and that's it for today again. So I really hope that you learned something new in this video. And if you want to see more, just like, share, and comment, and subscribe to my channel. And that's it for today guys, bye.